Bitcoin investors, it's been a tough year so far, hasn't it? Just before Christmas 2017, those prices were above the $20,000 mark. But from there, it just went downhill, probably much like all those New Year's resolutions. Bitcoin's price plummeted in Q1, and since then, they've really struggled to gain any continuous upward traction. So as we wait for the next bullish breakthrough, we thought we'd reflect on 2018 so far, including those market corrections, regulatory spats, and high-profile hacks. So first, back in January and February, very few market observers thought the coin's price would fall so hard and so fast. Some observers have pointed out the seemingly exaggerated correction was well within Bitcoin's historical limits. Zhao Chengpeng, the finance CEO, was one who highlighted the similar patterns in charts between 2017 and 2018. Then there's the regulation. In the US, the government announced that the so-called like-kind tax loophole would not apply to cryptocurrencies. Then there's South Korea, which appeared to be loosening its notoriously cautious view of crypto. That was until a series of high-profile hacks. Millions of dollars were lost around the world, damaging the reputation of many exchanges and perhaps even unnerving institutional investors looking to diversify their portfolio with crypto. And luckily, all these pressures appear to be temporary. And with Bitcoin price predictions all over the map, it's impossible to be fully confident what the future holds. Popular electronics production giant company, Samsung recently announced about officially accepting cryptocurrencies as a payment method in three Baltic states. As of now, customers of the three Baltic states, which include Latvia, Lithuania, and Estonia, will be able to purchase the products of the company by using the coins of list of different popular cryptocurrencies. According to the official information which was passed earlier, the accepted cryptocurrencies by the company for these products include, Bitcoin, BTC, Ethereum, ETH, Ripple, XRP, Litecoin, LTC, Steam, Dash and Nim. The news that Ripple is officially in the list of the accepted cryptocurrencies by the major producers such as Samsung adds measurable value to XRP. This also proves that the cryptocurrency meets all the requirements of the field specialties to be discussed as well as listed along with such major currencies as Bitcoin, Ethereum or Litecoin. In addition, considering the value of Samsung and the positioning of the company in the market, it is only obvious that the company would only include those cryptocurrencies in its list that meet the true definition of the term. The key specialties for listing Ripple by the major company were reported to be mainly the fact that it is decentralized, is practical as a currency, and has wide acceptance. Meanwhile, as the recent official announcement by Samsung was out, the value of the accepted cryptocurrencies by the company in the stated markets has not been moving much. According to field experts, the key advantage of such developments for the listed cryptocurrencies is the general attitude towards them in the eyes of the users. As large companies like Samsung prefer to work with these digital currencies, the customers have more trust and higher perception of those.